Good morning, everybody. I'm a little raspy <laughs> this morning, but I'm going to drink some hot tea and I think we'll be good to go. All right, here we go. Romans chapter 12. Let's start at nine. Let love be without hypocrisy. Abhor what is evil. Cling to what is good. Be kindly affectionate to one another with brotherly love and honor, giving preference to one another, not lagging in diligence, fervent in spirit, serving the Lord. Rejoicing in hope, patient in tribulation, continuing steadfastly in prayer, distributing to the needs of the saints, giving to hospitality. Bless those who persecute you. Bless and do not curse. Yep, and 544 is also another good scripture. So I need to read that. So yes, it is hard sometimes to be nice to people who are not kind to you. But Jesus did it and we need his help to do it as well. Have a great day. Good morning, everybody. We're going to read Psalm 25. To you, O Lord, I lift up my soul. O my God, I trust in you. Let me not be ashamed. Let not my enemies triumph over me. Indeed, let no one who waits on you be ashamed. Let those be ashamed who deal treacherously without cause. Show me your ways, O Lord. Teach me your paths. Lead me in your truth and teach me. For you are the God of my salvation. On you, I wait all the day. <sighs> we need to continue praying. The world is getting super crazy. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's just crazy with all these political ads and people just doing some crazy stuff to one another. We need to be continue praying. We need to be fasting. We need to just talk to the Lord and cry out to him. We cannot give up. Good evening. We're going to read Matthew chapter 5. And seeing the multitudes, he went up on a mountain. And when he was seated, his disciples came to him. Then he opened his mouth and taught them, saying, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they shall inherit the earth. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they shall be filled. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called sons of God. Blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness' sake, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Um, I really like to, I know, I have chicken scratch. <laughs> These are sketches. Whenever I read the, the Bible, I like to draw, and it helps me remember the scripture. So it's talking about uh, they'll see God and those who mourn and the rewards in heaven and it's a pure heart. Good morning, everybody. I'm so glad you're here and you are alive. You have a purpose. Don't forget that. Let's read Psalm 3. Lord, how they have increased who trouble me. Many are they who rise up against me. Many are they who say of me, there is no help. For him and God, Selah. But you, O Lord, are a shield for me, my glory and the one who lifts up my head. I cried to the Lord with my voice, and he heard me from his holy hill. I lay down and slept. I awoke, for the Lord sustained me. Go ahead and read before and after. Keep on going. You have a purpose. There's a reason why you're still alive. Don't forget it. You are, you are wonderful. You are wonderfully made.